Hey everyone. Oh jeez. Look at the view. So I just finished my uh, trauma counseling session like about half an hour ago. So I just excused myself to go for a walk. I got myself a strawberry frappuccino. I can't have any caffeine after 3 o'clock so I'm trying to stay away from caffeine. I think that's the reason why I've been having migraines is because I stopped drinking coffee all of a sudden. So yeah, I did record it, a voice record the uh, session. I, I just want to listen to how my mom was talking because the thing is I didn't feel her being genuine to be honest. Like she was saying like, oh, I, my attitude changed or like it's a work in progress. Like she was talking about my attitude. Here's the thing. I have, I don't know what I did to like give her that, the feeling that I'm giving her attitude. Like it's just has to, it just comes down to like how she talks to me. And it's really irritating how she talks to me. Like she talks to me like I'm a child, not an adult. And I'm talking to her like an adult, trying to have an open communication. So yeah. Anyways, that was interesting. I actually had a dog that just walked by and I had a conversation with them and it's just about the dog having diabetes and needles so this is a thing I really wish my mom could see like how I interact with other people and it's literally just not that hard. Like it's not that hard to like get to know me but she just have a hard time like trying to understand me and and then she just shoved her views like how I should be when really I'm an individual person but anyways such a nice day I'm enjoying this view I'm literally maybe five ten minutes away from my house yeah tomorrow's gonna be a, an adventure day it's not going downtown I just see my family doctor for the first time because my other one left her parking so Thank you for it is. I haven't been down there for like, oh, since my birthday last year with my best friend. Yeah, that's fun. Anyways. Hey everyone. I have an adventure to go to. Just down to Vancouver actually. It's nothing so special. But anyways, come enjoy a day with me. Because it's going to be spectacular. Because I'm actually going to go downtown to... Uh, Hornby-ish near St. Paul's Hospital area because that's where my family doctor is but so yeah we're gonna go on an adventure we are just going to have some fun today um probably some Brecca coffee I just want to just treat myself anyways I will show you my exciting adventure so stay tuned <laughs> So 
got myself a cappuccino cake pop from Rekka. They always have like nice things, like apple strudels, like cakes and stuff. Yeah, so this is just a treat. I'm gonna try this out, so don't mind me biting this. It's very soft. It's not overly sweet. I don't really taste like uh, cappuccino. <laughs> definitely interesting um so now now i have a family doctor so i'm not like frantically looking for one so my situation was that my my previous family uh, doctor she closed her practice it was really unfortunate because i actually like built a rapport with her for three years and i'm a little sad that she had to leave but I have a new one. She's a little bit younger. So the thing is, um, I'm situated in South Surrey and I have a family doctor down in Vancouver. So the thing was is that I didn't want to look uh, for a family doctor down uh, in Surrey because I'm not planning to stay in Surrey. I'm just only here for temporary. Um, just temporary to live with my mom and figure my own stuff. So I don't even know what's happening right now. Uh, like, I can't find work. I'm frantically always looking for work, but it's really hard. I'm having difficulty there and also trying to find a place to move. Everything's so expensive, so I'm trying to ride it out. And also, I don't want my mom to know that I'm not in school anymore. This you know, is actually really good. Um, anyways, I'm just gonna quickly chow down that cake pop. I had fun walking around downtown. Funny story, when I was going there for my interview, I had <laughs> some bomb that came in and was like needing to see a doctor. And one other thing was that they were puking. And it was very close to me and I was just waiting for my interview and they ended up puking and I was like wow this is like a very good um first impression of the clinic <laughs> but yeah like I miss working downtown to be honest like I like that you know fast pace and also the clientele's and also food food was such an amazing place especially I wanted to film myself eating but I was like mmm I'm not that type of person to like to film myself eating. I think that's about it for this episode. If I ever end up going to any adventures or specifically food, I might do a little bit more on that. But yeah, so far right now I am trying to take it day by day and see how it goes, but renew my serving it right and start applying as a server now because honestly if I want to move out I wouldn't mind working as a server working at nighttime and if it's close to where I'm living then I would work and save that money and move out so be it man whatever <laughs> to hustle this man I am honestly I don't really want to live with my mom anymore especially like yesterday when we had our family counseling session she said like I have an attitude problem and like I'm still like my attitude is getting better like no woman if you had to pay attention I stopped caring about you <sighs> I just need to start caring about myself and remove myself from such a negative environment anyways hope you guys have a good week I will see you in the next vlog